Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Rokia. Um, it's Rokia? What the fuck was that? Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Rokia. Um, if this is your first time coming through, welcome to my page. Please like, subscribe, and comment if you like this video. Um, if you don't like this video, don't be too mean. As my friend Sally would say, that's not nice. All right, today, basically what we're doing is a review of a bunch of hijabs, not a bunch, four hijabs, that I bought from this place called Culture Hijab. You might know them from Instagram. Um, they used to be called Hijab Loft, but then I think they switched recently into Culture Hijab, which is pretty cool. I like Culture Hijab. I like both names. They're pretty cool names. Um, but I've been seeing them on Instagram a lot, and they recently launched this, like, suede hijab campaign like suede scarves and I was just like shook because I don't think I've ever seen a suede scarf before that's like wearable as a hijab so um, that definitely piqued my interest but I've been on their page for a minute I've been following them and I follow people who really are close to the brand um, and have been advertising for them so I decided to buy a couple of their scarves and um, this is kind of a review, first impression review. I'm actually wearing one of them right now. This is an olive um, colored jersey hijab. Um, jersey is a material, is a kind of material. If you don't know what jersey is, it's a really soft, breathable, stretchy, like just versatile. I love it. I think this is my favorite material. Um, cotton is eh. Um, chiffon is a dub like Unless I'm going to a wedding or I'm wearing lace or something that it complements, I'm not wearing that at all. Um, and so I really love jersey. It's just like nice and breathable. So I bought this one. I bought four hijabs total. This olive one that I'm wearing right now. Um, this camel one, it's also, it's also jersey. It's slightly stiffer, I'd say. A slightly different jersey. Um, I think it is still jersey, but it's just a bit stiffer. Not as stretchy. It feels not as... Um, breathable it feels a bit more texturized I don't know how else to explain it I don't know if it'll pick up on so that's the material I don't know if that does anything for you and this is the material of this one you see what I'm like it's a bit more think about have you ever been to American Eagle and you see they're soft they're soft the soft something soft and sexy I think or something like that they're t-shirts that are really soft that's Jersey I think that's what this reminds me of um, I like the feeling of this olive one a bit more than I do of this camel one, but I still am gonna definitely wear this. So this is, yeah. And this is with, you know, like little to no effort. I'm an over the shoulder type of hijab girl, you know what I'm saying? I don't like for it to be too tight. I do like to have a bit of a loose kind of, um, what is it? Like a kind of, just hangs. <laughs> Just hangs, really. Um, I just really throw it around shoulder once. I like for it to be tighter in the lower neck area, not necessarily right under my chin like this. I got two more that are the suede, um, and I think that's really, those are really what I was interested in. I mean, the jersey have always been interested in. I know jersey is my favorite type. I just wanted to try a jersey or two from their company to see if it's any different than the ones I get from the halal stores or, you know, just around. Um, and that one, the olive one is a bit more of the jersey I'm looking for. This one, not so much, but I'm not complaining. The suede ones? Okay, so <laughs> these suede hijabs are so pretty, first of all. You can see it looks velvety, like suede. It is very suede -y. I'm going to put it on. Oh. Like, sis, do you... Do you see this? It just flew over my shoulder like what? Nothing, no business, no problem. I got it. Mm. And I've never heard of a suede hijab or a scarf before. So this is really a first and I really, really love this one. Um, this feels really nice. I think it's breathable. It's a bit stretchy. Um, I feel like you can definitely do a turban style with this. You can do whatever style you want with this. I think on the website, actually, one of the people is like, they're wearing it in so many different ways, not just like a hijabi, they're wearing it as like a top knot scarf with your hair out, very cute. Um, so that's that. I'm gonna try the black one on. Do you see this? Darn it! I'm with it, all right? I think I'm about to wear this out tonight. <laughs> so cute. There's something else about it. 
not completely black and I love it. I love it. I feel like it's going to bring a little bit of flavor. It's a little bit of spiciness to the outfit, especially if you wear an all black outfit and you put this on. Boom. It's like it's like the earring, the the that extra big cat eye. It's like that oomph, you know? I'm really a fan. I was going to judge these on three categories and three categories were basically how, um, how much it actually resembles what it looked like online like is the picture what I got second is price and third is quality and I will say for it looking like the picture they really all look like the picture the white one gorgeous the olive one looked a bit darker in the photo I'm not gonna lie like three shades darker it looked deep olive but I like that one the camel one same thing so in terms of what it looks like online i'll give that a 99 percent out of 100 because just because of that olive being a bit lighter than i wanted it to be because i have these olive pants and i really wanted them to match price i'm gonna get to it. that's gonna be the last one um quality quality bomb all right there's four hijabs three of them are 100 percent like these two suede ones and that green olive one Perfect. 10 out of 10 would recommend. That camel one, it was cheaper. I'll say that much. It was cheaper than the other three. Um, and I think because it was cheaper, the quality was meant to be not as, I don't know, tip top. You know, I think maybe it's the thread count. Maybe it's the layering. Something about it is off. It just seems a bit cheaper. So I'll give, I'll give like an 87. The price is... Definitely something that I was and I'm still concerned about. I can't speak for the suede. I've never seen suede hijabs before. I've never seen suede scarves before. So I can't say that the price I paid for the suede hijabs are too much. Just generally speaking, $24 for a piece of fabric is OD to me. But then again, I don't know how they make this material. Could be a lot of work. Two hijabs period was $50, you know? So I feel like I had to choose um, wisely and I chose two colors that I feel I'm gonna be able to wear with every outfit um, or like a bunch of my outfits because they're both neutral and they're both basics that I feel like everyone should have I paid the price and I'm really enjoying them I really really do like them so I'm cool with that the jerseys I'm confused so the olive jersey was $15 and the camel jersey was $12.95 so there's like a two dollar difference between them and personally I don't think they should be that expensive I feel like if I was really to go to a halal store or to like JCPenney or something or even H&M forever I feel like you can find similar material now quality I actually yeah I can I have like multiple jersey dabs and I feel like I bought them for like bundles from the halal store and they're pretty much the same quality as the olive one but I know that these jerseys could be sold cheaper like relax because it's jer it's jersey it's not like an exclusive material they make bed sheets out of this material like I feel like you know it's not that big of a deal but anyways that's just me but the price is definitely something I was like hovering over that checkout box for a bit and I definitely held out on it like this is I've been looking at this website for a minute really what persuaded me to buy it now is because I really wanted to try these suede hijabs but before that I was just going back and forth with like do I want to pay that much money for a jersey like hijab, do I want to pay $15 or do I want to pay $12? And so that's it for this review. Thank you so much for watching. Um, please make sure to share, subscribe, like, all that. And until next time, be happy, be blessed, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.